We were saying hallelujah artistically this morning. I'm going to tell you about it later on. Welcome back to Sunrise. Now, the vision is to bring the message of Jesus Christ to theatre through the performing arts working towards this goal is a multi-denominational team called Freedom Ministry, comprised of talented individuals from various churches in Jamaica, coming together to raise funds to support various individuals, churches, and organizations. Writer, actor, Freedom Ministry Administrator, Paula Thompson. She comes this morning to tell us all about Freedom Ministry and their upcoming event. How are you doing, Paula? I'm good. You good? Yes, I'm good. Good that's, to that's see you. That's fantastic. <laughs> People are wondering, Freedom Ministry, I, I, what, what's Freedom Ministry? What would you tell them if someone is asking, you know? It's a, I would say it's a Christian theater organization with just volunteers, persons who are volunteering their time to come and participate in the performing arts. So we spread the gospel of Jesus Christ through the performing arts, whether it's poetry, music, mm -hmm. drama, mime, whatever you call it. We use that medium. That's our platform to spread the gospel of Jesus Christ. That's interesting. So I can turn up to a play and get the message. Yes. So is there an altar call at, at the at, at Sometimes we have had we have had altar calls at um, at our performances. Yes. But the thing about it is that what is unique about Freedom Ministry is that we look at social issues. Okay. okay. So it's not just um, biblical issues. Right, we right. look at social issues, relatable issues. People can relate to it. So at the end of a performance, somebody can say, oh, but that's my life. Oh, yes. that's good. That's, that's good. And, and therefore, we have Jama Fest. Yes. Talk to us about Jama Fest. So Jama Fest is an annual festival where we, over one weekend, we, we just portray different productions. Oh, okay. So um, like in October, We'll be having Drama Fest. We have three different productions mm. over that weekend. Yes. Three different three productions? Three different oh, productions. When I go to a play, I see the same play, the same play every yes. night. But you have three different, so three different sets of actors and actresses? Sometimes we have the same persons in two productions. But what we try to do, not to burn out people, but we try to have different persons in different productions. So that is what is unique about Freedom. Oh. Yes, different productions. So. Tell me the name of the production. So on Friday night, we have Idler's Corner. Mm -hmm. On Saturday night, we have Poisonous Proposition. Poisonous yes, Proposition. Yes, Poisonous Proposition. That's interesting. And on Sunday, we have Family Thicker Than Blood. Mm. Yes. So Idler's Corner is like, you know, they do something for me mentality. Yes, yes. Yes, and Poisonous is, is almost how far would you go to get what you want. Mm. So it's interesting. And then Family Thicker Than Blood talks about commitment of a family and the trials that they will go through. Is there a memory experience or event that, that you remember um, after a production that you, know, you, you share? If, if somebody's experience is shared with you that you, you want to highlight, to say, oh, you know, on this day, at this production, this happened, and I, I can't forget it. Yes, there was a play that we did. I think it was our first drama fest in 2016, Single Mistress. Mm. Yes, that play, when it was finished, there was a lady that came. She, she came crying to the altar. And, I mean, we didn't have an altar call, but she came crying, and she said, that's my story. Whoa. Because it, that story was about a, a single lady who was trying to do everything to get this man to marry her, but guess what? He was already married. Oh, okay. Yes. So she just came and, and she was saying, that's my life, you know? So it's, it's evangelical and it's deliverance. So right there and then we were able to reach somebody and just have that, that prayer with her and Whoa. just... Um, and when you're writing, I mean, you, you, you don't know who you will reach when... When, when you're when, writing. When you're writing, I mean, and of course, that experience, you know, yes. underscores the very reason why you do what you do. I want to hear more, and I'm sure you want to see more. Of course, we have Jamali, Jawara, Sharice, Kemal, and Yohan here. Who are they? You will see. Stick and stay. We'll take a quick break and come back because I want to hear more. Don't move. I'm awesome. I can't be this no longer, you know. Hunger star. Bet, bet. Bye for me. Oh. 
my my. Yeah, no, I try to do a scully. Keep on it. Yo, what kind of food this Betty give me? This not even can feed me. Me plus my pitney plus no, none of my baby no, mother. Then. Money now my belly long, you know. A foolishness this. A style Betty, a style man. And this year this is a program. Young man, I'm not a good. I'm not food this man. <laughs> Yo, what? You happy for nothing? Yes. You yeah, listen to me, man. You're not happy for this, you know. I have this Betty, I have this way. This is a style. You know, say for somebody else a big food, then should I give them? Coffin box. Double box. Mm -hmm. Listen to me, man. Yo, me pee a jar now. That was good. Stand by. Coffin straight to you, so stand by. Energy, energy, energy. Next energy. time in your life. Energy, energy, energy. So, Timmy, you know hungry? Boy, you know, some mommy cook some good breakfast, give me still, you know? So, I'm not refusing the food. <laughs> Yo, Bertin, I can't be here this no longer. Yo, me need I know, man. Yo, but we're going to trust two food from Miss Nettie. Right, right now, right, 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 right now. Yo, do something, do something. Right now. I bet he did that. Even better. <laughs> yeah, man. No, man, I'm good, man. Bet. Bet, bet. What is it? You know, say I show you those, Scully. Hold this. Yeah, Mr. The Food Nice, 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 that not even can't feed me hungry belly pitney, plus none of my baby mother of them. She listen to some man a big man. Yo, me is a mad man and my belly long in a man. Yo, how me for survive for half a dumpling and piece of chicken in me? A foolishness this. A style shall style me in America. And this year this is a program. How you mean? Yo. Yo, when I talk about man them, I know food this man. <laughs> yo, 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 give me this. You yeah, are pay for nothing. You are talking. Eh? Yo, I this. Betty, I this way, you know. What do you mean? You, you, you know, say for somebody else, a, a big food to raggy them? Yeah, coffin box. Double yeah. box. Stop me, I said to. Yo. Yo, we, we, just calm down, no man, you. Yo, I just say, it could have worse. At least we get something to eat to all we hungry. Not you, man, them. We, 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 we. Where you get this we from? <laughs> you are pay for nothing. Eh? Yeah. As a matter of fact. No, you say you have mother and father we give you a big breakfast this mm. morning. Yo, listen to me, yo. Mm. I bet you go back to your mother and your father, you know. Right now. Make them give you a big lunch, you know. Because right now, you know, at this, bet you at this way, we are straight out, you know. And you have to know when people are styling you. Know, and you're styling that. You hear me, son? Yo, you're soft like porridge. Your mama's boy. Wait, cracker. What? Yeah. What you know about Zing Fence? Bordos. Gunshot of fire. You're a liar! What do you think? Yo, man them. I go down the road and sell a man and kill me right now. You don't know the thing going on. Sorry, you betty. Man, them leave here, Mr.